Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another weekend, not week, week of my weekend of my life vlog. Today is Friday. I'm about to go work out. I'm wearing this year of our set that I literally always wear. I'll have it linked down below. I know they sell it at Urban. I'm about to go downstairs and do 12 to 30. I look crazy right now. Dom and I woke up early and we did Devo's and now I'm gonna work out. We have a very exciting day ahead of us. So I will let you guys know what we're doing after I go work out. But wanted to start the vlog here. Love you guys so much. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. Um, I think this is gonna be a good vlog, so I'm excited. Again, this is what I'm wearing. I've shown this in so many vlogs, but it's just like one of my go-tos. It's so festive in here. Okay, guys, um, so it is Friday morning and we are headed to get tea, some holiday tea, by the way. It's festive. Um, it's very exciting. We're confused on attire. Honestly, we should call them. So anyways, I'm currently getting ready. I just put on my Rare Beauty Foundation, which honestly has been a fave lately. Favorite bronzer, as we know. Um, I'm really hungry, and if you guys have ever gotten tea before, the food that you get is like a joke, so we need to eat before. All right, guys, I'm back in the same spot. I have no idea where my phone is. I'm going with this like black and white little moment. It probably isn't warm enough to wear this coat, and I haven't worn it yet, it's from J. Crew. But this is my outfit. The shoes are Princess Polly. They're just like little heeled sandals, and then the sweater and the pants are Revolve. These are girlfriend denim. They definitely need to be taken in, but I'm just kind of doing like an oversized look. This sweater, no wait, is this sweater Aritzia? Yes, I think it is. I think it actually is Aritzia, but just cute, really simple. I'm going back to this like vintage Gucci bag I got at Vintage Martini Consignment. Why am I forgetting everything to that? So cute, and then I don't know if I'm gonna wear the coat or not. I'll probably bring it in my car and just see, but I think the coat like adds to the look, you know what I mean? So we'll see. I'm just wearing my normal Jennifer Fisher hoops, and then this claw clamp, I don't know if, maybe if I go like this. Genius, this claw clamp is Amazon. So, that is the look for today. Been the way they be acting. They're wild. They're they cute. no like Alyssa, you don't understand. Fitz has been what? I swear it's like I picked them up from the groomers this week and <laughs> they've just been out to get me. Like I just don't understand that's not oh they're going straight, so I'm literally gonna die. But um, they're obsessed with you. Yeah, like they definitely love me, but like they just have like something is wrong. Yes. Okay, so we're pulling up speed on this guys and ballet. Woo. Please have um Anything to have? Yeah. Hello. Sadly, okay. Mask on because he's coming. Okay. Mask, mask on. Mask on. Yeah, mask on. Hi. Do you guys do card for ballet? Perfect. All right, guys. I'm really thriving. Is this the apple cider? Yeah. Non-alcoholic. Alcoholic. Non-alcoholic. Cider. Cider. Apple cider. They were giving complimentary rosé and it was shut down, shot down very quickly, so. We're being good girls. Yeah, so. Oh my god, it it's really good. Is it good? Yeah. It is so beautiful here. This is your house. Yeah, see, like. So beautiful, and this is like only one part. You guys have obviously seen more with my stories that I make. Delicious. Delicious. Dom is trying to be turned now. Yeah. Then me. No, she picked her camera up when you picked it. Like, yeah. how? Because come on. <laughs> wow, guys. There's actually a lot of food for a tea room, so I, I feel good about this. Excuse my mask, guys. It's so ugly. It was the only one I had in the car. Amanda and Dom are in the bathroom, so I almost said Amanda and I are Alyssa and I are out here, there's not two Amandas, but the Adolphus is so cute. It's one of my favorite we places. We want to live here. Yeah, I really would love to live here. It's just so cozy, like, it's so cute. The French room was really, really cool. It was fun. And it was actually really filling too, which was shocking. Like, we're we were full. full the first, like, course. course. I almost said the first round, the first course. It's fancy here, people. We're so, that's good, but I love it here. I, like, want to stay here one time. I mean, I don't really know the point of that, but like, I just want to come. I feel like that's fun. That's a staycation. We should, we do, should that do that. For, like a holiday tradition. We don't have a free weekend this holiday well, season. Um, so we're booked we're, and busy. December is 
probably our busiest month. Busiest month of the year. Like, We've got a lot. We have going something on. going on every weekend. Every weekend, we really do. So. So next year. Next year, we will. Be like, unless you're here to get your ass beat, <laughs> then I suggest you walk the other way. There was a guy at the gas station who was like hitting on me and Dom was not having it. Okay guys, tea was so good. I'm glad that I'm actually full. I'm going to get a lip flip surprise. <laughs> this was a randomly, like a really sporadic decision. And a lip flip is like not injections. It's just like, I think it's a little Botox on your lip. I don't know, basically like a really good friend of mine who I would not expect to like have anything like that had it and it was so natural looking and stuff and I do work with this med spa in Dallas and I get like one thing a month and I was like honestly I might as well try it it's not permanent it's like not a big deal at all so I'm just gonna try it and see how I like it um and if I like it then I think Dom's gonna do it but I'm the guinea pig yeah. so it'll be I think it's gonna be a good experience which is what I'm excited for I also what time is it right now it's 1 Getting here we are. All right, guys, got my lip flip, feeling good. Um, it was actually not that bad. They put numbing stuff on me, and she told me that it was gonna hurt. And this is the lady that does my Botox. I kind of want to walk with all these people. Um, anyway, oh, this is the same lady that does my Botox. So I am Med Spa, guys. I also have a Black Friday thing. If you use like Kenzie 40, you get a deal. It's on my Instagram stories. But wait, I'm gonna go for Kenzie 40. Kenzie 40 Black Friday deals. Um, anyways, it didn't even hurt like honestly at all I thought there was gonna be two more and then we were already done and then I couldn't even really feel it at first My head jerked back because I wasn't like laying back. That was a big no-no I was about to get in trouble for that one, but everything was fine. So now we're going to get our peppermint cold brew What a Dallas day Dallas Where it's, day. it's Snyder's Plaza. They have a nectar here. That's very good um, It's right by SMU so lots of SMU kids, you know and Golden Goose sneakers. <laughs> <laughs> That's like my thing of like how I can tell it's an SMU kid is that they wear Golden Goose sneakers. It's about to be Dom. True. True. Wait, what? Speaking of Golden Goose. No, literally, what did I tell you? This wasn't planned. All right, guys, we have my drink. This Christmas I used to go tree. I to Mathnasium because I was stupid. Uh, Okay, Dom, just because you went to math museum doesn't mean you're stupid. No, you're I was like studious. actually bad at math. <laughs> Listen up, guys. I don't know where Dom is going. Ooh, it's dark. Okay. So like essentially a lip flip doesn't make your lips look bigger. It just, just makes lips. this, yeah. yeah. Which I needed to clarify in the video. Sorry to all my haters. Anyways, so we just went on a little walk around Snyder's Plaza. It was really great. We went to like another designer consignment store, which honestly, like Dallas really has good ones now. Yeah. It's also because Dallas has a lot of money. So like- They were crushing. They had like really it. sick off-white, these like off-white Nikes and stuff. Yeah, I liked this one better than the other one. Just I feel like they had more stuff that, well, I don't know actually. No, I think I like them equally, but as far as like bags and stuff, for this higher, one. higher end like yeah. stuff, they just had like a very refined collection. Yeah, sure. and I really liked it. Um, we both found bags that we loved, and we made some friends we made as we friends. always do. Miss Rebecca, Miss Rebecca, the store manager. We love her. So my lip update on that feels uh, numb, and. Yeah, it feels like a little bit odd, but do you think we're like gonna be in for the night? I mean, it's 3 p.m., but like, or do you think we're gonna like, like, what are you, what are you feeling today? Well, the thing is, is all right, guys, I'm back in my room. It is Friday night. I've just been on my bed, honestly, editing for the past few hours. I haven't fixed my makeup since I got the lip flip, so I need to go do that. But I did just take a nice bubble bath because I just needed it. It is so pretty outside right now, but I'll show you guys what I changed into. I'm wearing Twin Flames Keen and Nat's clothing line. Keaton actually, I think, will be here this upcoming week. Thank God. So we're going to have some good girl time, but I'm just wearing this Twin Flames hoodie. These jeans are girlfriend and then my Air Force Ones. So that sometimes when you are stepping out in faith and God's calling you to do something, you have to answer the call. And right oh. now that call is going to Sonic. <laughs> and, and yeah, and yeah, maybe it doesn't make a lot of sense right now. The calories aren't adding up to what I would have God do in my life. But uh -huh. at the same time, you cannot say no to the will of God over your life and the call that he would, when God calls, are you gonna pick up? 
<laughs> that's what I'm gonna leave you with here today. And if this message you know was speaking to you and was trans, you trans can text nine seven seven nine. No, nine. new life to nine seven seven nine. You can um. Right now, they will actually answer. Uh, they want to pray with you right now at the Sonic Drive. -thru. We've got real pastors on our we team. We have real pastors on our prayer team right now that are ready to pray with you at the Sonic Drive Thru if you would answer that call. So you let me know, Kenzie, and and like once again, the choice is yours. No pressure, no burden, no nothing. Conveniently enough, we're Just, pulling into Sonic right now. Don, would you believe that? So and you see what God? I'm gonna tell. Let me tell you what God is about to do right now. What God is about to do right now is something that you guys have something not new. seen before. Do you ever think about how that verse is so taken out of context? And every time people, yes. ever since college yes. ruined that for me, <laughs> yeah. I'm like, um. I'm like, you would never, you never I'm know. I'm like, read the passage. <laughs> you never know. Guys, what God would so be. that whole thing was dumb. Well, first off, what she said before we were on camera was funnier. <laughs> uh, no offense, but like we couldn't. Some things are just like meant for us, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, anyways, um, I'm taking Dom to Sonic. Yeah. I pretty much manipulated the Bible to Spiritual get Spiritual manipulation. It's like date in the church. Yeah, you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? Like, <laughs> uh, what do you want? I think I do want a Sonic Blast. Thank because... you for obeying the call. You know what? Your, your obedience is other people's freedom, Dom. Thank you. Oh! <laughs> She's struggling so hard. They can walk on. Like, my car just that works. went into you know the what? abyss. <laughs> I, I don't even think it's scanned, so we're gonna have to give it to the guy again. I wanna live a life that's just like unlike the one I'm living right now. Amen. So I just need like some things to happen, you know what I mean? Guys, the most embarrassing. Yeah, can you just made an absolute. <gasps> okay, so we were like. <laughs> I can't even like review what we were doing. We were just being so ridiculous and then we were like twerking in our seats. We were like this. But like to like audio that like it would be it's like really funny. Yes. And uh, all of a sudden Dom goes, oh and the lady is <laughs> standing outside of my car like right there. with Dom's sonic drink. It was so embarrassing. I think she would have thought it was funny though. She really no. knew what was going if she on. heard it. If she, she heard it, like... she would get it. If I heard, I heard the voice of God. Oh I heard God. the voice of God and it literally said, Well, Millie shit, bitch. <laughs> Have you seen that TikTok audio? It's so funny. I am so tired for someone who went to bed at probably like 10 p.m. last night. All right, guys. I'm aware that the last clip we had was us going through a drive through Do you want me to lock your door? I don't know why I'm so tired this morning for someone who went to bed at like 9 or 10 p.m. Dude. So tired, and we're going to Chick Fil A for breakfast. Okay. We're at Starbucks too. Um, hi. Can I have a grande vanilla sweet cream cold brew, but sub vanilla for peppermint, please? Do you want something? Can I try that? I think that I just don't really like Saturdays that much because Saturdays like aren't as busy and structured. Mm -hmm. So that's why I just don't really like them. But anyways, we're getting Starbucks. We got our Chick Fil A. Woo. What a morning, it's gonna fall now. Yeah. Honestly, this is like my favorite drink ever. I can't believe we haven't had it because like I got ZLC hooked on these last year. Oh. I cannot believe that that was only last year. I actually, at this point in my life, I would go back a year ago. Ooh! It's really good, right? This is good. This is great. All of your favorite people from the program, they love this drink. I like this. Ooh! Mm-mm-mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, well here's the thing. I think I actually would, I never thought, I never thought I would ever say I, Oh, sorry. What was that noise? It, it sounded ice. like your teeth. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh my God, that was so scary. Sorry, I'll never um, do that again. Thank you, thank you. Um, no, I never thought that I would ever say like, oh, I want to go back to Bible college, but like I actually would in a year happily 20, go back. In the year 2020, at this point, I'll go back to high school. <laughs> yeah, care. literally. Actually, we had one semester. I actually love my experience for the most part at college, but we had one semester that was like literally the most fun semester of my entire life and I will go back to that and just relive that semester for the rest of my life as long yes. as I live. I really would. That semester was just God, like, was so fun. I did honestly some of the craziest like, <laughs> not like crazy like, ah, but like I will never forget KJ so and I, we, okay so our friend KJ was talking to this guy who went to Pepperdine and so we 
literally God, I forgot about it. We him. drove to Malibu because that's where Pepperdine is. It's so far from We would West go Hollywood. study at Pepperdine. Yes, we so literally I... would study in like okay. Oh. Anyways, it was a lot. <laughs> One day, it's just KJ and I. We hang out with this dude. Um and like it was so much fun. And in the the, the next day, he's like, Well, do you guys want to go see the sunrise? We had class the next day. And we would have to we had to get up at we would have to get up at 3 a.m. to see the sunrise. And KJ was like so down to see the sunrise. Uh, she would be. KJ and I woke up 3 a.m. go drive all the way to Malibu and then go see the sunrise, get breakfast with this dude. It's like 6 a.m. by the time we're done. And then we have to rush all the way back to West Hollywood in time for school. Yeah, it was just stuff like that, like literally 24 seven. Just like- We also had like anarchy. a stalker that oh. <laughs> that period of our life. Like there was just like so much stuff that was just like, not that part, but like that was just so fun. And it was just, everyone was friends. No one was dating anyone yet. No and one. that's why it was more fun, I yeah. think. Because we were all just together 24-7. Yes. My god, it was so much fun. And we were just laughing all the time. Yeah, so remind us all to not date people again. Because, yeah. like, it was so fun during yes. this period of time. Being single is so fun. Is so fun. It is so fun. It is so fun. Even yes. though I'm sure having a boyfriend, like, that's so fun, too. But, like, being In, like, a different sing- way. Yeah. Being single is, like, so much more fun with your friends. Oh, my. Guys, ignore my window. That's dirty. But this is our view as we're sitting, eating our breakfast. So good. I hop in the lamb. Wait, we might be onto something here. The window's open. A skateboarder with, with a truck. Wait, turn around. I just want to ask him a question. The, uh, Dom, no, 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 Kenzie. I like want to ask him a question. Come on, turn around. What, what question do you have to ask him? I'm gonna ask him. Be like, do you know how to do a kickflip? Come on. He's leaving. You suck. Dom. You never want to have fun. Something happens and we see him every day. No, yeah, he what? He's he gonna want to be my friend. Yeah, I'm sure maybe he would. And then maybe we kiss once. Oh, yeah, exactly. Exactly. God, Kenzie, you know what? I just, it's like constant disrespect. You know, it's just like, I don't feel like, like turning around. Honestly, had you thought of it earlier, I would have been like, yeah. No, but. no. And it's like, and you know what's so funny? If it was your, the love of your life, do you not, you'd hear skid marks. Absolutely. Like, do you skirt. know me? Like, it would skirt. Stop. In what world have I ever talked? Have skirt. I it's ever skirt. wasted my time on talking to a boy before mark. they talk to me? Never. Not once. Name one time. Whatever. I'll See, just mumble in. It's because it doesn't happen. It doesn't exist. Anyways, guys, um, all this to say, we are on our way to the craft store because I decided that I'm going to sew. So we're getting a beginner sewer kit, oh. sewer, sewing kit. sewing kit. I was just watching some YouTube videos, some TikToks. Um, I don't know much. I probably should have, I should have for sure done more research. But, um,. This is what we're doing. My grandma also, it's like a really big thing in my family. She's a seamstress, she's a professional seamstress for years and years and years. This is definitely probably something I should ask her more about, but I just wanted to really impress her as I'm following in her footsteps. You know? So cute. It's so cute. Must have seen me on TV. Bestie? All right, everyone, here we are at the craft store. All I want to do this weekend is bake an apple pie. Never done that before. Read and sew. I actually am like approaching 70. Listen, hopefully I'll just get really stubborn. Ooh, ooh. This part is not big enough. Watch out, Dom. I mean, this is really all new levels. Like, everyone's probably thinking that I've lost my mind. Dom, wait, which one is it? This and this and this. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that one too. Here we are. Look at me go, guys. It's gonna be a really busy, wild quilt, but it's okay. Dom is being forced to help me. Ooh, baking. Oh, oh, can't do this without you, Dom. This is quite the... Oh, whoa. it's like a roller coaster. Woohoo! Uh, this is quite the craft store trip. I got everything that I thought I could possibly need. You may be asking, Kinsey, where might one start with their sewing career? I'm humbled that you would ask, really. Um, let me just share with you what I got, okay? 
The first thing is my sewing machine over here. That's a big thing. Second thing, I just got a lot of um, random stuff. I know um, shears are great. I, my grandma just asked me for some for Christmas, so I actually just bought a pair before. I just felt like this would come in handy. Then we have, this will be the batting for my quilt. So that's that. This is, you guys already saw the fabrics. I have my work surface, which is what you like caught on, right? You know? Exciting. Ooh. Um, then I needed to get a iron and an ironing board, which I actually didn't have here. I'm gonna start getting with my setup. I'm gonna make some coffee. It's about 3 p.m. and I'm so tired. I'm heating up some chili right now. I think that will be good. And I'm just gonna, um, I'm gonna hope for the best. I really have no idea, like, how long this will take me. You know, uh, seeing as how I haven't sewn since I was 12. And guys, it was the cutest thing. I texted my grandma and she wasn't responding to me. And then she told me that she saved my sewing kit from when I was 12. That's so cute because she knew I would come back to it. So at least I have one there at her house because now I'm like, well, I already bought one, but okay. Forgot to mention this little So It Goes kit. All in one, everything that you need. So I did get this, which I think will be nice to have. This is the sewing machine that I got. Look at this, guys. I have a LCD display. Guys. Here's my sewing machine unboxing. I should've gotten ready today, guys. Ooh, oh my gosh, guys. First off, I didn't even know it came with, do I need this? Ooh, here's this thing. Didn't even know that it came with a box. Now how nice is that, guys? Wow. So cute, I have no idea how to use this thing. I've got some soup going, I've got some coffee being made. I'm currently winding the bobbin, and I had a little bit of issues with my machine, but no worries, I figured it out. You guys can't really see, but... It's been a few hours, but here is the first thing that I'm going to sew. Okay, I really just wanted to see if this thing works. Hello everyone, it is a little bit later. It is Saturday night, a wild Saturday night as always. I <laughs> spent my afternoon setting up my sewing machine. Then I've just been cleaning the house. I showered, self tanned, all that stuff. I FaceTimed a friend for a bit and she's having me do like this journal exercise. So I'm gonna do that tonight. It's kind of like a self care. I feel like every day for me is a self care day at this point. Hello, hi. Just took the dogs on their last little walk. I'm going to journal and read for the remainder of the night. 